subscribe to the YouTube channel and also click the bell icon to get all the notifications of latest videos. New Zealand bowling coach Shane Jurgensen feels Joe Root might be a fantastic player but facing pacer Colin the Grand Homme is certainly a challenge for the England skipper. In the ongoing first test, the Grand Homme didn't allow Root to score off 29 of the 30 balls he bowled to the English skipper. The New Zealand all-rounder deceived Root on several occasions on the second day of the opening test. Jurgensen loved watching the Grand Homme bowl to Root from the Lord's balcony as the pacer dominated the proceeding against the England skipper. Colin certainly presents a challenge for Joe. Joe's such a fantastic player. A very good captain, and it's a great battle, and me personally, I love watching it from up on the balcony, stuff.co.nz quoted Jurgensen as saying. On the speed radar you may see 115 to 125 km per hour, but as you see when he hits the cricket ball, and he hits it a long way, he's extremely strong, so he does bowl a heavy ball and one thing that's what you say yesterday, he had the ball either jumping up or down and was getting some movement, he added. Meanwhile, rain played spoil spot on the third day and not a single ball was bowled before play was abandoned due to rain. The start of play was first delayed and then the day was eventually washed out. England is trailing by 267 runs, having restricted New Zealand to 378 on the second day of the opening test. On the second day, Devon Conway's double turn and tight bowling from the paces helped New Zealand gain an upper before Root and Rory Burns held the fort for England. England will resume their first innings from 111 halves, with Burns 59 not out and Root 42 not out at the crease. Thanks for watching.